If you want to catch your audience's attention within the first seconds of your video, this is a great editing technique to use. Hey guys, it's Amaya Brooks. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, or if you're new, welcome. I have another super easy editing video for you guys. It's supposed to be getting teacher. I don't know, I just bought a tie. I thought it would be funny and look cool. Anyway, moving on. This is what I'm going to be showing you guys how to do today. Let's get into this tutorial. Okay, so for filming, we're going to want to film a blank background first so you want to get basically this clip right here the second part is filming the fall so you'll just film your best falling from the ceiling moment period so i'm gonna start by importing my video which technically there should be two separate videos but i filmed it all together so it's one here i'm just cutting the video up to make it two separate videos that first video should be the background and then the second video should be you falling down with that second video we're gonna start with the first point of me falling and i'm actually gonna split it and then I'm gonna delete the first part of that so you should have basically like the ending of a fall and then at that same point where I split the video I'm also gonna take a screenshot of my body and so then we're gonna take that screenshot you can put it into whatever app you use I use canva to remove the background so I'm gonna go ahead go into canva crop it crop out the background as well so you should get this little cutout picture and then in that same place where I cut it I'm actually gonna insert that photo right there so now I'm taking that video and I'm gonna position it so that the background of the video and the picture match the exact same and then I'm gonna add a keyframe which is over here I'm then gonna expand it so then it's going forward I'm gonna click at the beginning of the picture and then I'm gonna drag the picture all the way to the top and it's gonna automatically add a keyframe for you and then everything to the right of that first keyframe that we did I'm gonna delete so then you should have something like this and then you can also adjust it kind of like this if you want it to be like slower or faster I'm also gonna adjust the background clip so that it's not so long so here I'm just cutting a little bit off the front so the video just starts a little bit faster and then also I'm gonna make this into a comment compound clip and then I'm going to add motion blur so that way it's very seamless and very beautiful. And now I'm going to show you guys how to do it on the app version. Good morning class. I'm going to be showing you how to drop down from the ceiling. <laughs> So we're going to start by filming the background and then we're going to film the fall. Make sure the camera does not move. Very important. Then we're going to upload these two videos into CapCut. And for the first part, right where I'm falling down, the first point of me falling down, I'm actually going to take a screenshot and I'm also going to cut it where I took the screenshot. I'm then going to open up Canva. You can use whatever app you want. It's totally up to you. But yeah, so I'm going to take that picture, remove the background, and then I'm going to add the picture into CapCut and then add it as an overlay, which is saying that's on top. I'm then going to match up that overlay to the point of falling and then I'm gonna add a keyframe I'm gonna expand the overlay forward and then send that guy up and then add another keyframe so you should have the two keyframes then I'm gonna delete it at the point where I took the screenshot and then you should have something like this and then I'm also gonna go to animations and then just add like a drop down animation so that way there's a little bit of a motion blur and it's a little bit more flowy and then feel free to add effects and sounds and that's it for this editing tutorial. Make sure you go follow my Instagram and my YouTube channel. I'll see you guys in the next vid. Bye! Make sure to follow my Instagram for mobile tutorials and to also keep up with the trend. Make sure to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And that is it for this tutorial. Super easy, right? Literally so quick. Make sure to go follow my Instagram account and follow this YouTube channel for more edited videos. I'll see you guys next week. Bye!